Hi everyone, this is Crafty Decoria and I hope you're all doing great. So today I'm excited to share my usual Dollar Tree haul with you, but even more excited because I also have a review and a giveaway to share with all of you as well. So I was contacted by a company called Yod. Now it's spelt the way you see it in front of you, J-O-R-D, but pronounced Yod. And um, they asked if I would review one of their watches. So I just want to make it clear that this is not a sponsored video and what I mean by that is I'm not paid by them to say positive things about their company. But they did very generously send me the watch that I'll be showing you today free of charge to review. I have visited their website many times on my own in awe of their amazing men and women's handcrafted wooden timepiece watches. So the watch that I chose, and I'll be showing you, is from their Dover series, and it's the Koa and Black model. I chose this for my son as he completed his homeschooling, and for me, watches make the absolute most perfect gift. He was so excited and happy to receive it because it really is like no other watch he or I have seen. We love the fact that it is made of wood, to give it a more rustic, earthy, yet luxurious look. So to begin, the watch arrived in this really nice black retail Yod shipping box. Inside is a cover with the circle punched out to give you a glimpse of the wood and the initial J engraved for, you guessed it, Yod. So removing the cover, you see this gorgeous cedar valet watch box. It is said to be one of the most luxurious wooden boxes with a function. Okay, so I'm going to remove the Cedar Valley box and look how beautiful the box is. Just beautiful. Inside the box you will get a Yod 100% natural finishing oil. It also comes with a like a microfiber cloth and a polishing cloth, a social media card, you get a instruction booklet with information on how to care and maintain your watch and then I also have a couple of extra wooden links and pins in case I need to adjust my watch, the band now, when you do order from Yod, they have a print, uh, a sheet that has a, or a page that has a ruler on it. So you print that out and then you cut it out and then you wrap it around your wrist and that will give you your measurement for your watch. But it is nice that they do give the couple extra in case you need to make it a little bit bigger. As well with the finishing oil, when you receive your watch prior to use, you should use the finishing oil with the polishing cloth um, on your watch and then it's recommended that six months after that, you use it again to protect your watch. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and open up the box. Now I'm just going to pull up on it and you can see that there are magnets so the box is magnetized and that is how the box stays closed which I absolutely love and on the inside is this beautiful beautiful watch that Yod so kindly sent to me well now to my son and it's just beautiful so again, this is the Koa and Black model in the Dover series. And it sits on this nice plush cushion. So I'm just going to put the watch aside for a moment just to show you a little bit more detail with the box. So inside again, you can see Yod and there are vents in this box. So the box is vented as well. And the reason for that is because this box not only being beautiful it has a function so at the very bottom there is a drawer which is also magnetized so you can see the magnet pulls it in now on the Yod website they sell the Bavita two-way humidity packs 
and you just place one of those packs on the inside of the drawer and the reason is that being that these are wooden watches they can release or absorb moisture so when you're not using your watch you just place your watch in the cedar valet box and you'll be sure that the watch is kept in a constant and stable environment now yod does treat the watches with tongue oil to finish and protect them so they are splash proof but they are not water resistant so regular washing of dishes or if it's lightly raining outside is fine but you don't want to go swimming or shower with your watch on now about the watch so this is a stunning watch it is made of koa wood which is native to hawaii on the watch they've attached this wooden token and it has the letter j for yod and me being crafty decoria will not let this little wooden piece go to waste the funny thing is my son's name is joseph so i will be attaching a metal uh, ring to this and then adding some uh, necklace string to tie to it and it'll be an extra bonus that he can wear and then keep in the Cedar Valley uh, watch box as well. So I thought that was kind of neat. Worked out well for him. So with the watch, the face is what is called a skeleton face. If you look through, you can see the gears and mechanisms of the watch, which is pretty cool. I love the black with the koa wood because it gives it a rustic earthy look, but the black and the silver also gives it an elegant look. So it's a really nice balance. Now here's my fingers. If I put it, put them in behind the watch, you will see that my fingers, you can see them moving in behind. So you can see right through to the back of the watch. Now, before I show you the back, let me show you the clasp so that I can open it up so you can see a bit better. There is a push button on this side and this side. So you just push them in together and it opens up the clasps so that you can put your watch on with ease. Now, before I close it, I'll just show you the back here. So in the back as well, you can see the gears and the mechanisms. A really neat thing is on the back, there is an outer ring here and they have the date and the place where the watch was made so mine says january 1st 2018 and it says that it was born i don't know if you can see it here it says born in st louis so i think that adds a really nice personal touch to the watch as well so in closing the watch again you just take the one side push it down, take the other side and push it down. Very, very simple. This watch is uh, automatic self winding, so it requires no batteries. If I turn again to the back, now I'm gonna have to open it up again because you won't be able to see it as well. There is a rotor in the back here. And when you have the watch on your arm, with any mo movement or motion, that rotor moves back and forth. And what that does is it's actually uh, winding the main spring and keeping the watch wound. So that's really neat as well. Now, if you noticed when I was showing you the face, there is a little piece of styrofoam here. So I contacted the company and told them showed them some pictures and they apologized about it and said that because they hand assemble these watches in their hair warehouse there's a lot of packing supplies around and this little piece of styrofoam must have got in so they told me to just take it to any local watch repair shop and that they would pay to have the styrofoam removed so that was very kind of them um, I can't say enough about their customer service. They respond very quickly with any questions that you have. And um, 
I'm just very thankful because they have been so generous um, and I'm really, really happy with the product again as well with the service that they provide. Okay, so now for the giveaway. In partnering with Yode Watches, they are giving away $100 off any watch on their website. To enter is super easy. Just click on the link in the description box below of this video. That will take you to the contest form, a few seconds to fill out the form, and you're entered to win. Also, Yode has given me a promo code to give to you, so even if you don't win, you can still get $25 off plus free sizing, whatever watch you want if you enter the promo code Crafty Decoria. If you haven't visited the Yode website, I highly recommend that you do. They also offer backplate engraving and presentation box engraving. And if you or someone you know owns an Apple Watch, they also have Apple Watch bands by Yode. They are wood and titanium interlace compatible with 38 millimeter and 42 millimeter Apple Watches. Again, I wanna give a big thank you to Yode Watches for contacting me to do a review on this amazing watch. It is a watch that we will treasure for years to come. Don't forget to click on the link in the description box below for your chance to win and use the promo code Crafty Decoria for $25 off a watch of your choice and free sizing. Thanks so much for watching and now on to the Dollar Tree haul. Okay, so now moving on to the Dollar Tree haul. Well, I did find a few new items at my Dollar Tree and if you've seen the thumbnail, and the title of this video, you know my most exciting find this weekend, what it was. It is hidden in here, but as usual, here is an overview of the things that I picked up. I will go through them one by one so that you can have a better look. I hope you enjoy. Okay, so to begin, I just picked up some repurchases I needed to restock on some of these items. The first thing that I picked up are the bamboo coffee stir sticks. You get a hundred in a pack and they are by the kitchen company. I picked up some more of the sassy and chic cosmetic wedges. I use these for reborning and they work great and um, you get 28 pieces in a package, so that's a good deal. I also picked up these SureFresh Zipper Seal 40 bags in a package, and they are the portion packs, and I really like these ones here. They have the measurements on here, so there's a cup, three quarters, half a cup, and a quarter cup, so they are portion packs, and I do like to use these. I also picked up, now these were new to my Dollar Tree, I had not seen them before and when I had seen these hauled I was really interested to see how these work. They are the Poo Be Gone and the two scents that I picked them up were in Fresh Citrus Scent and Lavender Vanilla Scent. I picked up a couple of the Dawn Dish Soap, the three times uh, more grease cleaning powder and I also picked up this bottle which was the item of the week it is a nice size bottle and it seems a little bit more sturdier than other ones that I've picked up there before at the Dollar Tree it is 26 ounces so um, that's a nice size and I picked it up because what I like to do is I mix half and half of dish soap with vinegar and then I just spray it in my shower and tub area. I leave it for an hour and then I go in and rinse everything off and it just makes everything so nice and clean, super white. So this was a hack that was going around YouTube and I was really interested to try it out and it works fantastic. I picked up a few more hats. These are the Snugadoo, Snugadoo 2 Super Soft Hats, the kids' hats. And I picked up two in blue and two in pink. These work really nicely with the dolls that I am going to be reborning. So um, yeah, I picked up those. I also picked up a few more headbands. These ones here 
I picked up in blue, green, and yellow, and they're just plastic, but they have these um, cat ears on the top, and the ears have the gems that go around them, so it gives a little bit of glitter, and I thought they were really cute. And then the other headband I picked up was this black and white one with this really pretty bow on the side. I also picked up a lip balm by Mariposa and the scent that I, or flavor I picked it up in was green tea. Moving on in the floral department, I ended up finding only three bags of the Excelsior. They tend to go quickly this time of year because of course they resemble hay, which make these great for fall DIYs. I also picked up two of the copper metal tins or containers, and these as well make a nice addition to any fall decor. Over in the craft aisle, the first thing I came across were the wall decals. So these are the Super Mario wall decals. You get 11 on a sheet. So these are great for anyone who loves gaming and Super Mario in particular. I picked up a couple of those. I picked up a package of the jump rings. These are four millimeters in size. I also picked up this suede jewelry craft cord. It is, um, three millimeters by 6.5 feet so two meters and it is a hundred percent suede and these were both from craft medley I picked up a couple stencil brushes these are by jot and they are the number number one stencil brush I also picked up a scrap tility knife set by forever in time and they have six assorted blades. So that's a nice addition to my crafting tools. And then I picked up the Jot Do-It-Yourself stencil wheel. Now there were a few different ones, but the one that I liked the best was the Owl. Okay, so these items I found all up at the cash register and they are new items to my Dollar Tree. So the first is this talking unicorn horn pen. Now I didn't find that it talks, but it does make a sound. So when you press the button, so I thought that was pretty cute. Then I picked up this mermaid pen by Jot and it is a pen stylo and it is in black ink. I brought home a couple of these sunglass clip holders and they had these in different colors as well but I picked up one in blue and one in white. And then these were really nice, a really nice find. They are the kissing ball um, keychains. So I picked up one in the purple, one in the fuchsia, and then one in this really pretty uh, green. So to finish off the haul with the seasonal items, I have more for fall than I found for winter, but these are really cute finds. I did pick up some more pumpkins. The first one here says Eek, and it is a heavier pumpkin. The three in behind are much lighter, but are adorable. This one's in black with the gold glitter spiders. I picked up one in white with the black glitter spiders. And then one in orange with the black glitter bats. I picked up these fun flashing LED multicolor pumpkins. So these are really neat. And I found them in the two sizes this wider one and then this taller one 
However, this one here, the battery is dying on it. I should have checked it before I put it in my cart. But I thought those were cute. Then I picked up a couple of these candle holders and it's the shape of a spider with these cute googly eyes on there. I also picked up a couple packages of the pumpkin tea light candle holders. And these are orange and they are glass. They're really cute to just set on a table. I picked up this pumpkin decorating kit. So these are plastic pieces that you just press into your pumpkin, sort of like Mr. Potato Head, the same concept, but I thought that was really cute. I picked up this ice cube tray in the shape of pumpkins. So these are great for ice cubes, but they also make really cute bath bombs as well. And then in behind here, I picked up these um, boxes, these pumpkin boxes, but they have the little green handle. And I picked up one in each side. So they go from tallest to smallest. All right, guys, so I have two more items to show you. They are seasonal for the winter. They are ornaments because my Dollar Tree is starting to get out all their ornaments and I can't even believe it, but I, the first one I picked up, I picked up only a couple, are these mason jar ornaments and you can unscrew the lid and place something inside. Really cute. And then the red truck. And this is an ornament as well. It is super cute. So the back here, this is like a hard plastic. I'm not sure what this piece is. It could be plastic as well, but they've covered it in glitter. glitter. Then they place the tree on the back here. And then there's two pieces of wire on each wheel holding up the sign. And I did grab quite a few of these because I have a feeling that this is the type of item that if you don't grab it when you see it, you just may not find it again. So I was super excited to find this. Hopefully this means that there will be more red truck items at our Dollar Trees. So that will do it for this Dollar Tree haul. I was really excited to find the things that I did. I also want to mention that I did bring my watch from Yode to the watch repair shop, but I got there at the last second when they were closing, so I had to leave it there and they're going to remove the styrofoam for me. And again, um, I was reassured that whatever the expense that um, Yod will definitely cover that. So I'm excited to get that taken care of and then have my son start using his watch. He did wear it around and boy, did he ever get compliments on the watch. It definitely is a beautiful watch and I really do hope you check out their website again enter in the link below in the description bar to enter the um, contest for the hundred dollars uh, giveaway off of a watch of your choice remember there's also that promo code which is crafty decoria which will get you 25 dollars off and free sizing of a watch of your choice so that will do it guys i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up Share the video if you can, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. And as always, guys, you take care of yourselves, and I hope to catch you in my next video. Bye-bye.